check me here. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'm going to share with you guys how much I spend in a month, roughly the amount. Because in this video, I'm gonna just tell you guys from now in this video, I didn't include me getting waxed and me getting a pedicure. Anyways, I'm gonna bring you guys around with me and I'm gonna share with you guys how much I spend in a month in Jamaica on stuff, okay? So if you guys are interested, because I'm excited, and you guys are gonna see my bill, it's really not a lot. Uh, make sure you guys stay tuned and let's get into this. Today's video, I'm gonna show you guys, or share with you guys how much I spend in a month in Jamaica. So I'm gonna pay some bills. I can't bother with bills. Overwhelming, but we're gonna do today. Like, I don't have to do no car payments, thank God, because I don't deal with those type of stuff, and I don't have rent to pay. So, so the first place we're going to go is the insurance company, and I'm kind of nervous because I didn't get to pay last month because I wasn't in the Junior because I was in, sorry, I was in the I was in a different country, and the insurance company that I'm with they don't have the option of you playing online, right? So of doomed i'm scared how much you're gonna charge me so i only pay 7,500 a month which is like not bad in jamaica you have the option of paying every six months once a year or every month right anyway so i'm kind of nervous to go up there i just go behind me the place called bcic that's where i pay insurance that's the first thing i have to go take care of so follow along let's get it. so this is it Okay, so I'm paying for my insurance now. I'm at BCIC, they're really nice here. It's two girls that work at the Spalling's branch. So, guys, no one told me that maintaining cards, no one told me that maintaining cards are so much money. Insurance is like good down here. Imagine only paying 75 in Canada, I think I was paying 180 a month. I can't remember. So, I'm just waiting for my receipt. And they told me that I can pay, pay online too. So, they gave me a card for that. The customer service here is really good. They're very friendly, nice. They're kind of slow, but it's okay. It's mainly women that work here. Guys, maintaining a car down here is so much money. I need I need to make like um two million a month and I'll be okay. Yeah, two mil. Anyway, so I'm gonna probably start paying online from now. But since I'm always in spalling, I might as well pay in person. But when I travel, I can pay online. So I'm not seeing anything. I look ugly and rough. What time do you think I should come for? Because I'm gonna go to Mandeville. Um Okay, and then come back after. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. All right, okay, I just called my hairdresser because I go to her a lot in a month. So I'm gonna show you guys like how much. You guys, I'm gonna talk about more once I'm there at her place. Okay, guys, I need you to share this video with your friends and like this up and comment. Because when you comment on my videos and you like them and you share them, it boosts engagement for my videos and then YouTube will promote them more. Um, and then I get paid more. So, <laughs> I need to get more money. Anyways, I got my receipt from them. I'm here with the top tattoo artist. <laughs> Outside, is it? <laughs> Wait, people want to know your Instagram. Oh, Instagram. Do you remember it? Yeah, I'm on Leon Inc. Six, oh, okay. And again, you guys can always come up to the plaza right behind me. Let me see if you guys can see it. It's right behind me. And you guys can go to his place. I told you that my sisters, I'm go to him. I don't go because I don't do tattoos, but my sisters, I'm go. Yeah, I'll make a start soon. No. <laughs> Baptize him. <laughs> I was telling him that I don't like owing people. I don't like balances. I don't like owing. This is why I don't put car on loan. I don't do none of that stuff. It just stresses me out. It overwhelms you. Imagine every month you have to pay for a car, yeah. plus insurance, and then plus gas on top of it. No, man. <laughs> it's true, though. It's true. Yeah. So, this is not really included in my monthly bill because I, I literally stopped buying things and I literally 
stop. I stopped buying things, I stopped buying food on the road. But I'm going to buy a party right now because I'm hungry. And when you're doing errands, you always end up being hungry. So that's what I'm gonna do. What's up? I was in Juicy Beef, I spent six. $160 on I think three or four patties. I got a mega, a cheese, and a chicken. Juicy Beef does deliveries and spallings now, so we get food delivered and it's only $50. So that's good. I'm gonna start using them. Hello. Ricky. <laughs> hey guys, I'm with Ricky. Yeah. He came back from Europe. Yeah, nice to meet you guys. Yeah, so if you guys see him, say hi. Tell him that you saw him in one of my vlogs. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to the gas station. I think the gas station is called Kenshin or something. I'm gonna go to the gas station. Putting some air in my tires. This is free. Okay, so I'm going to put air. And air is free in Jamaica. So I'm at this. Tota. It's a little bit flat, don't it? Yeah. So that's what we're doing now. So I'm supposed to get gas over there, but there's traffic, but that's not what's it. The reason is they're putting in gas in the gas station. There's no gas here at Total Gas Station as well. So I'm supposed to go over there. It's called J Chen. I called it Ken Chen, but anyways, I'm getting gas here. And I think I'm just gonna put in five grand. So I'm getting gas here. I'm just putting five grand. 87. Guys, look, I'm on empty. So this is the um, most affordable gas station in Spalding. Bang. So that's it. Okay. It's full with five grand. Can you believe this? Life is good. Okay, so I'm at Flow here. And I go to Flow like once a month to do my plans. So that's what I'm gonna do. Right now. So I do the 28 day plan from Flow and it's 1,000. How much is the plan again? 2,000? Oh, why did I think it was 1,000? So the 28 day plan is 2,125. Yeah, 2,125. Have the number, please. Yeah, so it's um, 97. Okay, so usually they activate the plans for me on the phone, but I'm not doing that today. What I'm doing is I'm going to send the credit to my phone, and then whenever the 28 days are done, which is going to be in a few days. You can top up on their app as well. That's what I usually do. As well. But the connection is bad right now. Big bucks. So this is a part of my bill. So I'm not going to only pay... Say like, it's running to less than $30 Canadian. And any time I used to pay only $30 for my phone bill. That's it. Thanks so much. Thanks so much. Really? Yeah. Thank you. Later. So yeah. Um, I come here a lot. No Regular. Sorry, I have to use my phone because I forgot my camera in my car. So I'm in Mandeville. I'm going to go get my nails done. So I think my nails cost me like two thousand or two five. When we go up there, we'll figure out. Um, I, yes, I go to Dickens, but this girl in Mandeville is bad. Okay, her name is Glitzy Nails. You can follow her on Instagram. I am starting to do short nails and very basic, simple nails. That's all I want in life. So we're gonna go. She's in Bankhouse Mall. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Oh yeah, so usually I do my nails like, uh, I do them once a month to be honest. I do them once a month. Okay, so I'm back. In total, I spent three thousand dollars. Basically, it was two nine. But why would you just give two nine? Anyway, so it was three thousand dollars, and I did my toes too. So I did my toes. I did my nails. Girls, fucking guys, girls, everyone. This girl is so good. Like she's done the best shaping that I've seen. Oh, finally they blocked me in. I'm like, what the B class? This is a big. You guys see behind me a big, huge parking lot. These people parked literally right behind me, and it's the road. <laughs> and they choose to work like the nail shape is good. She gave me exactly what I wanted. I wanted nude, I want natural, I wanted everyday, so I can wear with every outfit because I get tired of designs and nails on my uh, nails after like a week or two. Not even a week or two, a day or two, sorry. And that's that so far. Now we have to go to Smallings, back to Smallings. I need to go get my car washed, I need to go do my hair, I need to go buy dog food. Oh, and for nails, I do my nails once a month, okay? I need to do my eyebrows and stuff, so. This is the before. 
Dun, dun, dun. It doesn't look dirty, but it actually is, especially inside the car. Let me show you guys. <laughs> the car's dirty, the seats and everything. Let me show you guys. I scratched my car. I scratched my car when I was driving because the country roads them have um, sticks sticking out when you're driving along the roadside. And then I scratched both sides. I scratched this side and the next side. So I have to spray over my car. So that's another, that's another expense I have to do. Yeah, let me know if you guys want a video of me doing all of that. <laughs> All done, all done, all done. Okay, washing your car is $500, so add that in. $500, I probably do that every two weeks, so times that by two. Washing car down here is cheap. But yeah, so I'm gonna go do my hair, and then when we're up there, we're gonna talk a little bit more, and I think I'm gonna do my eyebrows with the barbers there. Hey, Ryan's do my hair. I mean, do my eyebrows. <laughs> Okay, this is it. Okay, so he uses a razor. This is alcohol. Okay, he uses a razor. So, what would it be recommended that they come once a week? Or once? Every week. You don't think so? Or every two weeks? He says you would come every two weeks. But I think it's every week because you're using a razor, but it looks good. He does my eyebrows the best. The other ones, them thin it out. Okay, how much is it? 150. So you guys can times that by two in the month. So that's how much I spend on my eyebrows. Yeah, so you guys can times that by two. 150 times two. Okay. <laughs> Go do my hair, which is right behind me. Okay, I'm combing out my hair. I'm detangling my hair. I don't wash my hair so long. straighten it because my hair is always natural like 99% of the time when you guys see me in wigs and stuff that's like when I that's like very not frequent at all anyways so let's go for everything I did my insurance I paid 15 grand put gas in which is another five grand I bought liquid food here and there I did my nails which is two five but I paid her three thousand it wasn't two five it was two nine so but I gave her three thousand I did my hair oh my hair my hair costed $2.5 to wash and straighten. Canada wear, you would never get that in Canada. And then car wash, $500. So I, my budget today was only thirty grand, and I only have $50 left out of the thirty grand. Was it 50 or 100 Oh, $100 left. Okay? Um, Okay, but let's subtract the seven thousand five hundred because I was off a payment for one month since I wasn't here. So we're gonna subtract the seven thousand five hundred off the thirty grand. So this is the total so far that I have that I would spend. But I'm gonna add back on five thousand dollars put on for dog food and animal food. And so this is my total for the month. It's low. It's very good. But this doesn't include groceries. Okay, 
Groceries was the next property I would say 30,000 that I would spend. So in total I would spend like 60,000, right? So that's it for today's video. You guys comment down below how you guys like my monthly bill. Is it low? Because I try to keep it as low as possible. If I didn't have to pay for nothing, listen, I would be the happiest girl you met. <laughs> Yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys like it. I'm thinking of doing more financial videos in Jamaica, like different types. I have these ideas in my head, these video ideas. So comment down below if you want to see more or like up this video or share it to a friend. I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Or vlog.